We are all three back together here. Colby Jack, Michael Madrox, Dickie Wabash, and we are here to call some incredible EPW action, fellas. Moo. Oh, I missed it. I missed I it. I missed that so much. Madrox, I missed it. We have not. Guys, I feel like we. Oh, look, look at this. Real quick. Let's just talk about what's going on in the ring here. Oh, look at Jay Silva. So it was like, I'm nice, but I'll still pin your ass. Oh, man. Two count. Backfly. <laughs> I love it. Let's get this quick succession here. We got three fan favorites here tonight. Going at it. Oh, low bridge. Oh, knocking him off the apron. Security better get over there. But guys, I got to tell you, it feels good for all three of us to be back together. It's been a couple of months since we've all three been together as a unit. It feels great. We got some good action going on. We got some sparkling water. Moo. We got cows. We got Michael Madrox, baby. We got Michael Madrox. And right now in the ring, we have your new favorite. We have a side headlock. Hey, he says it himself, wrestling. Your new favorite, Jay Silva. Been a, about a month or so since we've seen him here at EPW. Same goes for Tyler Scott. But Benny Bray has been here grinding, putting in that work. Steamboat-like arm drags. That was beautiful. Colby, did you get everything straightened up at the slaughterhouse from last show? Oh, yeah, absolutely. I got to just... Wait, I don't work in the slaughterhouse. I thought you had an accident or something. No, I had to protect the baby cows from the slaughterhouse. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's, that's where he was last time. He was dedicating his time. Sick with the baby meal. Eat more chicken. By the way, guys, let's talk about let's talk about what Tyler Scott is doing right now. This is smart triple threat action. He is sitting on the outside waiting for these two to wear each other down, and then you know that he's going to come in and try to pick a spot. That's smart. Absolutely, and you notice that Betty oh. did look over at Tyler Scott, wondering Jake when he Silva. wondering when he will get back in, and he just came back in. 
Jay Silva with a rough landing and then being sent to the outside with that triangle drop kick. Take a Silva home day. Let's in fact go, says Tyler Scott, but oh no. Tyler Scott giving up a good 50, 75 pounds to Benny Bray, it looks like. Benny Bray rebounds oh, off the road. Stiffski. Stiff Larry and Will Stiffski on that one. They came for Stiff. They came for Stiff. <laughs> good callback. Exploder suplex. So under. What do we got here? Double in. Butterfly suplex right there, Dinky. You'll love to see it. One, two, two. kick it to Tyler Scott, never wanting to give up. May we meet again. One of the stars of the hit documentary, Danville Dreamers. The Wabash Cut now available on patreon.com slash Madbash Studios. Had to get that little plug ski in there. I was gonna I was gonna say that, but you gotta do what you gotta do, fam. You know what I'm talking about? Talking about doing what you gotta do. That penalty kick to the back. One, two, kicks at two. I mean, they don't call Jay Silva the Green Hill Zone Warrior for any reason, Dickie. Definitely trying to access all those chaos emeralds. Going for a vertical suplex, it would appear. Sending him down. Tyler Scott just lost all his gold rings on that bump. He's gonna try to give one to Benny Bray, it looks like. Sending, oh. oh, Benny Bray landing more on the small of his back. I don't know if you guys have ever landed on your tailbone, but it definitely does knock the wind right out of you. Ali's definitely got his hands full on this one. Oh, catches him. Oh, right to the bush. Double stop. Oh, he's on that Prince Devitt mode right now. One, two, kick at two. Guys, this crowd, capacity crowd here in Odin, Indiana, the eyes of the All-Father smiling upon us here tonight. Tyler Scott going for here. Look at Silva in the corner. I think we're about to find out. Or him upside the head will stop anything. Russian leg sweep from the Brainosphere. Benny Bray, the veteran of this match, the crafty veteran. That's got to be. Uh, he just called his spot, guys. Superplex. Let's see what happens here. Someone's hanging on, though. Oh, the headband of Benny Bray just fell off. That means that he's going to be 20% less effective in this match. I have it on good authority that that's what happens. Uh -oh. High rent district. What do we got in mind here, Silva? Feeling froggy. Whoa. Oh, not even, not even a chance to get a one count on that one. Tyler Scott, and now what's going on? Look at how quick Tyler Scott was to get back in. I don't know what he's, he's fighting him. He, oh, sends Uranagi. him down with a Uranagi. One, two. What a hot start. What a hot start. The action is here tonight. If this is just match number one, guys, we got five more big matches. And I'm excited to see all of them. Sit here with my Malcolm drink and watch everything. The crowds are clapping, but I have no idea who they're behind. I mean, who could you be behind at this point? Going around the world with his right hands. You hear Ollie in the corner, primetime Ollie Sharp said, open your hand up, we're not going to deal with some closed fists. Look at Tyler Scott firing up, getting him some. Sprints off with a disaster kick. Right to Vinny's face. Uh-oh. What's Silva got in mind here? Look at the deadlift on that one. Pour it up again. 
I think Silva just said that he's blown up. I mean, I, I think would he be... said he's going up oh, again. Oh, going up again. Okay. I can't hear. I got headphones on. <laughs> Listen, I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm trying to deal with what I got here. Oh, look at this. Oh. Kip up into the super box midair. One, two. How did he kick out of that one? Tyler looks shocked. That definitely could have been three. That should have been three. That just goes to show you the intestinal fortitude of Jay Silva. Nicky, I've been in the business for a long time, and I've never seen that sequence anywhere. Guys, I think we are witnessing one of the best triple Island threat. Island J-style forearms, Dickie. Sorry to cut you off there. I mean, I'm just saying, I think we are witnessing one of the zigzag, one of the best triple threat matches in the history of EPW. Look at Tyler Scott is just at a loss for words. How did Jay Silva kick out of that pin? Colby, what's your insights on the triple threat match? Every, I mean, it, it's anybody's game right now. Benny's the smart one staying out of the action right now, trying to catch his breath. I don't think he has much of a choice, Colby. Tilt a whirl. Doomsday zone. Doomsday zone. That's his move. Here's Benny. Running with Psycho Knee. Wait a minute, Silva with another Doomsday zone. Let the pigeons loose. Oh, where's Benny gonna go from here? Benny rolls through one, two, three! Benny Bray! What a sequence, guys. Guys, I said it a minute ago, but I'm going to say it again. That could have been one of the best triple threat matches in the history of EPW. I agree completely, Dickie. Props to Benny Bray for pulling out that victory. Ever since Benny's comeback, he has been unstoppable in this ring. Benny Bray has definitely been one to watch. You gotta wonder what is next in the sights of Benny Bray.